You are called to the scene of a motor vehicle crash where you find a victim who was thrown from the car. You find severe damage to the front end of the car. The victim is found lying in a field 30 feet from the upright car. Be as high as you safety? Your CNSA. Okay. Looks like I have one patient. My mechanism of injury is going to be MBA with ejection. I'm going to go ahead and call ALS for backup, and my partner is going to go ahead and take C-spine stabilization. For a general impression, we have a approximately 20-year-old female, appears to be unresponsive. Ma'am, ma'am, are you okay? No response. Okay, I'm going to go for painful stimulus. No response. Okay, I'm going to do a CPR check. Okay, I have a pulse. All right, we're going to go ahead and state that our patient's chief complaint is that they are unresponsive on the AFPU scale. Go ahead and move on to our ABCs. I'm going to have my partner do a jaw thrust maneuver and look inside the airway. <laughs> airway is uh, clear. Airway is clear. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and insert an OPA to maintain my patient's airway. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and expose my patient, cutting off their clothes. I am looking for any deformities. Do I see any? You see bruising to the left side. Bruising to the left side. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and palpate my patient's chest. Get a quick respiration rate. Eight. Eight. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and have my partner start ventilating my patient with the BBM at 15 liters per minute. I'm going to go ahead and auscultate for lung sounds in four locations. Take a deep breath. Clear. Deep breath. Diminish. Deep breath. Clear. Deep breath. Diminish. Okay, we have diminished lung sounds on the left side. My partner's going to be correcting that with the BBM. Um, okay, we're going to go ahead and move on to our circulation. Checking pulses bilaterally. We have strong and regular bilateral radial pulses. Uh, I am looking for color, temperature, and condition. Skin is cool, pale, and clammy for the scenario. Uh, I am looking for any major bleeding, checking the voids. No blood. No blood. Blood on your right glove. Blood on my right glove, okay. What type of blood is it? Capillary. Capillary, okay, moving on. No blood. No blood, okay. Our ABCs are taken care of. This is a high priority patient we're gonna transport immediately. Is there anybody around that knows this patient? No. No one's available for a sample history. I'm gonna go ahead and move on to our head to toe physical exam. Palpating the head, face. I'm checking the eyes for pearl. Looking at the ears, nose, mouth for any fluid, battle sign, raccoon eyes. I'm palpating the back of the neck for any step offs or crepitus. Looking for tracheal deviation and jugular vein distension. Palpating down the chest for any instability. Lung sounds in six locations one, two, three, four, and the bases. Lung sounds are still. Diminished on the left side? Yes. Okay. Diminished on the left. I'm going to go ahead and palpate my patient's abdomen for quadrants. Abdomen is soft and pliable. Checking the pelvis, pushing in and then down. Pelvis is stable. Checking both legs together for symmetry and then individually. Okay. Checking PMS, both extremities. Wiggle your toes. Channel my touching. Moving on to the upper extremities, checking them both together for symmetry and then individually. PMS, PMS is intact. Wiggle your fingers, which finger am I touching? Any injuries? Uh, no. Okay. Gonna go ahead and log roll my patients on my partner's count. One, two, three. Okay. Palpating the back of the C spine, the butt, the back of the legs. Onto a backboard on my partner's count. One, two, three. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take a blood pressure, systolic over diastolic. 86, 74. 86 on 74. I'm gonna take a heart rate. Uh, 120. 120, and what's the quality? Strong right there. Okay, and respiration rate? 22 BBM. 22 BBM, okay, my patient is showing signs of hypoperfusion. We're gonna go ahead and treat by keeping them warm and transport immediately. Um, this is a high priority patient uh, ejected from a motor vehicle. We're gonna give our report. Uh, patient has uh, diminished lung sounds on the left side, minor capillary bleeding on the left leg. 
We're gonna reassess every five minutes and 